Hi, I'm Dan Tapster. I'm the showrunner for the Netflix series Life on Our Planet. And I'm Tom Fletcher. I'm the paleontologist for the series. And we're here today to try and find out the backstory of some of the creatures that we brought back to life in the series. Here at the La Brea Tar Pits, the coolest lab and fossil site in the world. This is pit 6167. This is actually one of the most important fossil sites in the world. What we discovered is that this pit was active when the extinction took place in Southern California. We have saber-toothed cats and direwolves and horses and bison and camels and ground sloths, and then they all stop. And right at that point, everything in Southern California catches on fire. And we think that the reason that is, is that there are humans on the landscape. We see an inflection point where human populations in North America start to rise pretty dramatically. And when you come out of that, the megafauna are gone and the Southern California fire adapted flora, what we call the chaparral, has appeared. You guys want to go down into the pit? Yeah. So what, what, what's this that we're looking at here? This is uh, the pelvis of a giant ground sloth. Wow. I think for me, one of the most exciting things was seeing firsthand the evidence that a lot of our recreations are based on. I think what people don't realize is if you dissected our CGI mammoth, it is completely real underneath. It has a full articulated skeleton. Those fact files are based on your hard work and the research of others, and it's a vital tool to start us off to make these animals feel real. Even though we're talking about four billion years of Earth history that life's existed, there seem to be patterns emerging, you know, again and again and again, animals come up with the same solutions to the same problems, don't they? One of the things I think people might be most surprised about is just that simple idea that we are all related. Because we're related, we need to treat the animals and parts we share the planet with as family. 